Christ is risen, let the whole world rejoice. Christians the world over join once again in proclaiming the resurrection of Jesus from the dead. This moment of history, many years ago, retains its eternal significance as a moment in which the shadow of death was lifted and the victory won. Christ is risen is a simple statement. This simple statement sits at the heart of the Christian message. Some of the great examples of our faith, from the early Desert Fathers through to St. Gregory the Great and St. Francis of Assisi to St. Mary MacKillop, all strove to base their lives simply on Christ and to live this out in simplicity of life. In this they serve as models for us. Yet human beings so often make the simple complex. Therefore my Easter message is quite simply based on the fact that I believe that God is in our world and has come definitively into our world in Jesus Christ and that God raised him up from the dead, which shows that ultimately there is hope, there is meaning, there is victory. My message then is first of all Jesus' message. When he rose from the dead and said, Peace be with you. And I pray therefore and hope confidently for peace. Peace in our hearts, peace in our homes, and peace in our world. I pray particularly for peace in your own hearts and homes, because it is out of that that you generate peace to others. My second message is again from the words of Jesus. He said to his disciples, do not be afraid. And that is my message to you. With all the troubles and challenges that you may face, do not be afraid. Because God is with you. He is with you through his Holy Spirit. He is with you through the example of his son, Jesus Christ. He is with you in the help of other people who generate the Spirit of God. So do not be afraid. Have courage, because in his resurrection, in his new life, God in Jesus has overcome the world. He is risen indeed. Alleluia. I wish you a very, very happy and holy Easter. May God bless you.